Uh, feels a bit strange being back on this side of the comms, just like the good old days. Now, last transmission I got from Crow was just before you showed up. You said he and Glint were scouting ahead. Right. He called in some sort of anomaly, said he'd sniff around the perimeter. Personally, I prefer a little more direct approach. Did I ever tell you about the Hunter Vanguard before me? His name was Andal Brask. He was my mentor. Great shot. Terrible gambler. Still, we had this friendly little wager about what was inside the Traveler. I told him there's nothing. So of course Andal says, well then I'm betting on everything. <laughs> everything. Ah, lucky guess. The inside is a composite of the outside. You're gonna see some things you recognize, and some things you don't. Treat it all as real. Unless it ain't. But I can guarantee you the Shadow Legion up ahead are as real as they come. from our vision. That can't be a coincidence. Let's follow it. Kate, is that you? Glint, where's the damn kid? I've been trying to raise you both on comms for hours. Gone. The hell do you mean, gone? The anomaly we were investigating, it's... a construct of darkness, I think. A, a cave mouth. It felt wrong, like it doesn't belong here. I begged him not to go inside, but, but you know how he is. I tried to follow, I did, I did. That barrier, this place, the cave, it's, it's impossible for me to push past it all. Stay where you are. We'll find a way through. These locks control that barrier between us and Crow. Any ideas? Oh, I was never good at puzzles. It was always more a chorus thing. That's it. Do you see any other dials in the area? Affirmative. The Guardian will handle it. Please hurry, Guardian. Crow has no one to raise him if he falls. Glint, this ain't your fault. He's my Guardian. My responsibility. And you're his. I know you want eyes on him. But you need to stay out of sight until help gets there. Hey, what do you make of that bird that led us to Glint? Well, it seems pretty obvious to me. I think it's pretty obvious to you, too. The real mystery is why nobody wants to say it out loud. I will. A traveler. It's helping us. You're through! I'm coming with you. No, Glint, you hold. The Guardian will give us the all clear. This must be it. Lynn's right. This feels... cancerous. Like a blight. But it's... different, somehow. I... Ah! What is this? Indecision. Guardian. Your thrust into an unending life.
of certitude. It's in my mind, trying to tear me apart. Let us free you from this architect of your enslavement. No! Ah, I, I did it. I fought it off. Shut it out. No, no matter. matter. Our voice will suffice. to exploit Crow's memories? And, and the, the light, light. to give them form. Don't you see how beautiful it all could be? We offer it to erase Prince Aldrin's stain from the Dream City. To grant Crow dominion of the Reef, the Awoken, and all the stars beyond. But he chose pain. Crow believes he is resisting temptation. As do you. That material is immaterial. Only purpose can cure his heart. And he believes his capacity for pain is that purpose. It is why he subjects himself so completely to your traveler. This belief is taught. Conditioned into you, it can be unlearned. There, up ahead. Crow. Crow? Quiet. Listen. I've seen these veiled statues before. You have too. It's whispering something, but I can't quite make it out. Stop listening to it! I told you to wait outside. This place is... I don't know what kind of effect it's going to have on you. He's right, Glint. I don't care. He doesn't get to make those decisions for me. We're supposed to be a team. Guardian and Ghost. That's how the Traveler made us. I'm sorry. Don't ever leave me behind again. Promise. I promise. Let's set up camp outside. Kate's not far. Of course he isn't. Tell me you got the drop on him at least. You and the Guardian both need better boots. Well, maybe I'll get lucky this time.
It's hard to describe. It's like these pockets of darkness are physical manifestations of the witness's presence here. An infection festering. You said it spoke to you. In the dark. Tempting me. The witness knows what's in our hearts and minds. It promises to make it all real. Listen. Whatever the witness is doing to the traveler, our ghosts can feel it too. And it's spreading. Ikora would know what to do. Oh, don't worry, kid. We'll find her. Even if we have to blast our way through. I don't think it's that simple. Sometimes it can be. Let's just get our bearings again, refocus. Agreed. What a relief to see Crow and Glint again. That cave we found him in, where the witness tried to possess me. A malignant place like that inside the Traveler feels blasphemous. That wasn't just darkness. It was reshaped by the witness. Corrupted. No wonder it could project itself there. At least out here, the Traveler's light still protects us. As much as it can, anyway. My shell? Don't worry. It's not as bad as it looks. The witness barely left a crack. We take hits and we get back up again. Right, Guardian? Listen, the others spotted a location nearby that resembles the Io Cradle. Sounds like something that would be of interest to a warlock we know. That's the Helm signal. Mara, we can barely hear you. I'll try to boost the connection. Crow? Does this reach you? She can't hear us. I'll keep trying to clean up the signal. The portal remains unstable, and your enemy has barred the way behind you. The abominations you encountered are of the witnesses' making. This is but a fraction of the power it now wields. Using stolen light, it has created a new army in opposition to the one the Traveler raised. Stewards of the final shape. No matter. The Coalition convenes to devise a method of dispelling the Witnesses' interference. Keitel and Misrax have promising theories. Once this desperate attempt to slow us is left broken, we will rejoin the attack. Let my voice send you now, in flight, to strike down the Witness and all its followers. Go with hope and with vengeance.